In this demo, we'll go over how to rescale an object should you have made it the wrong size. For example, I have a wheel rim here and a tread. And you can see that the tread is larger than the rim should be. In this case, I've already looked and it's one and a half times what it should have been. To fix it, I'm going to create a new part. Do a standard .ipt as if I was making an initial part. Then you'll go to the Manage tab, select Derive. You want to choose the piece that is made incorrectly. And when it comes up, we have a scale factor in the bottom left. Since this is one and a half times the size that it needs to be, then it needs to be scaled down to two thirds the original size. So I'm going to put in 0.67 click OK and then I need to save it and when I do I don't want to call it exactly what the original piece was called because it will overwrite it and it's always referencing that original piece so I might call this one wheel tread and I call it correct or two or resized however you want to name it, just make sure you don't name it the same as the original. I'll save it, then go back to my assembly, and just to check it, I'm going to do a place. Get my wheel tread resized. Place it here, I'll go to the constraint, and I'm going to leave it on mate, and I'm going to use, what I want is the little axis to show up through the middle. So when I get the edge here and I get a line running through the middle of the wheel, that allows me to do it off the axis. Then I do the same thing for the tread. That lines it up. I'll apply it and then I'll flush the back side. And check it here from the front and it looks like that we got it sized correctly this time.